What's up Braves? I'm Cameron with your Braves News and welcome back to today's On This Day on History. On March 7, 1965 in Selma, Alabama, a 600-person civil rights demonstration ends in violence when marchers are attacked and beaten by white state troopers and sheriff deputies. The day's events became known as Bloody Sunday. The demonstrators, led by civil rights activist John Lewis of the Student Nonviolent Coordinating Committee and Hosea Williams of the Southern Christian Leadership Conference, were commemorating the recent fatal shooting of Jimmy Lee Jackson, a 26-year-old deacon, by State Trooper James Barnard Fowler. The group planned to march the 54 miles from Selma to Montgomery, the state capital. Just as they crossed the Edmund Pettus Bridge outside Selma, they were ordered to disperse. Moments later, police assaulted them with tear gas, bullwhips, and billy clubs. Lewis, when 25, was one of 17 marchers hospitalized. Dozens more were treated for injuries. That's all we have for today. Make sure to check out our YouTube channel for more on this day on history. And remember, Braves, keep on rising.